sorry. <laughs> that one's perfectly fine. Come on, Mario! Mushroom Kingdom, here we come! After 30 years of planning, we finally get a proper movie adaptation of the Super Mario game. The Super Mario Brothers movie was released two weeks ago, and I went to go see it in the theater, and I loved it. It captured memory so well that I was really into the movie. All the characters were there, the music, and of course, the nostalgia. Mario and Luigi were played by Chris Pratt and Charlie Day. I was doubtful at first as why they picked these two as the Mario Brothers. But you know, they did a great job. The film is about the two of them who placed an ad for their plumbing skills. So far, I love how they incorporated the Super Mario Super Show theme for their ad. Oh, we're the Mario Brothers in plumbing's a game. We're not like the others who get all the fame. When your sink is in trouble, you could call us on the double. We're faster than the others, you They finally get a call on Luigi's phone. I jumped when it, it was the GameCube theme. Super Mario Brothers! Sending them to underground Brooklyn, Luigi disappears and Mario discovers that he has been sucked into a pipe and follows him to another dimension. They get separated and Mario lands in Mushroom Kingdom where he finds Toad, played by Keegan-Michael Key. He helps Mario find his brother by taking him to Princess Peach, played by Anya Taylor-Joy. Meanwhile, Luigi gets captured by Kim Bowser, played by the fantastic Jack Black. He did a great job being casted. His motive is to marry the princess so he can rule the kingdom. He even plays a love battle which was the highlight of the film. Peaches, 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 ah, oh, yeah. Hilarious. Princess Peach, Mario, and Toad are on the trek to get Kong army to help them fight Bowser's army. And in order to do that, Mario has to fight. That's right. Donkey Kong, my favorite character. He is played by Seth Rogen, which he did a good job. There's so much nostalgic in this film and it brought back a lot of memories. The CGI was done great, the storyline was really good, and the soundtrack is mesmerizing. I love how they made the Princess Peach more of a stronger character than you would see as a damsel of distress like the video game. There are two post credit scenes that are really funny to watch, so if you're a Super Mario fan like me, go watch it. You will be satisfied. Peaches, 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 peaches